The future of this more than a square mile of land that's been up for discussion as a potential site for an electric vehicle battery plant now in the hands of General Motors. Local officials say we'll know by the end of the month whether the company is choosing this spot. We believe that we've done all the all the steps, so this was really kind of the last step. The St. Joseph County Redevelopment Commission approved the transfer of the options for the properties, which include three owners, two families in the county. It also approved a purchase agreement for those properties. St. Joseph County Economic Development Director Bill Shalio says the Redevelopment Commission land is only 21 acres of what comes out to 650 plus acres. That space would sell for more than $270,000. The other more than 600 acres would sell for $55,000 per acre. No, so this sets up the purchase. And so again, before the property can sell, the development agreement has to be signed. That decision now up to General Motors, which is still finalizing an agreement with Samsung at the same time. South Bend Regional Chamber of Commerce President and CEO Jeff Ray says he's confident in what the county is offering GM, as well as what the possible electric vehicle battery plant would give back to St. Joseph County. He says the wages alone will generate an economic impact of more than $600 million. And so never in our lifetime have we seen a project that has that kind of an impact. But he says the clock is ticking on GM's decision as that land is a prime spot for an electric vehicle battery plant with the Kankakee Aquifer and high concentration of power lines as strong resources for a plant. He says St. Joseph County won't wait on GM forever. Shalio adds there's also a farm payment due July 10th for which the purchase agreement says GM is liable for if the decision isn't made by then. He says that suggests the decision will not only be made soon, but that St. Joseph County has has a good shot at getting the outcome it wants. And if they're willing to make that kind of additional commitment to, to moving the project forward, we think that that's a really good sign that things are things are headed on the right track. Shalio says he expects to make a formal announcement on the decision in the coming weeks. In St. Joseph County, Anne Lurie, WSBT 22 News.